Hey guys, it is Tuesday evening. I did get back to work this uh, morning. I got some Amazon orders in the mail. I got an Etsy order out the door and I proofed a special pup named Bunny. It's a memorial project for a repeat client. Um, sweet looking dog. Um, I'm going to show you some of those proofs right now. I always show my clients um, kind of a tame version with a coat coloring and then maybe a medium you know colorful and then a very colorful so you'll notice that on the pup's coat it you know some of them have colorful highlightings and some of them are more natural and then I also show them um, a wide variety of background choices so we'll look at those right now okay so this is Bunny's original photo and it's a really decent photo the eyes show up well the detail in the coat is excellent um, I really love this photo and enjoyed working with it. My first step when I get a photo is to erase the background elements and then I enhance the photo, smoothing out things like the, the kind of the white highlights on the nose were a little distracting so I smoothed those out and saw anything else that needs smoothing and then I start painting. And so this, this first proof, proof number one, is one of my favorites. I really like that background and it's got colorful highlighting. This one has a little colorful highlighting on the coat um, and then the, the third proof is all natural. I show them, so this one doesn't have any colorful highlighting on the dog itself and sometimes people like, you know, tame coats. Um, I think this client's gonna like the bold colorings because on the ears and the nose because that's what we did for her before with her other pets. So wide range of looks I've got tons of different um, background options for people to, to choose from. So anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, I'd love to do a pet portrait for you. I work from regular snapshots and I print it onto artist grade canvas. This is what I do. This is my day job and I love it.